What if Finding Nemo wasn't just a movie, but a window into real ocean life? Let's start with clownfish. Yes, they really do live in sea anemones, but in real life. It's the female that's the boss. And if she dies, the male can change into a female. That's wild, right? Now, remember Bruce the shark? Real great whites aren't friendly like him, but they're not bloodthirsty either. They're curious, cautious hunters, not movie monsters. And those sea turtles riding the East Australian current. That current is real. And turtles do use it to migrate, but not like they're surfing a racetrack. Lastly, the fish tank scenes. Fish don't talk, of course, but yes. Being trapped in a small tank can stress them out just like in the film. So, how realistic is Finding Nemo? It's a blend of fact and fiction with just enough truth to keep us hooked. Love Ocean Facts. Hit like, share this with a friend, and dive deeper by following us for more.